the giant owl, Snow Shao, is affectionately embraced by a little girl with kisses on both sides. Surprisingly, instead of resisting, Snow Shao responds gently with happy sounds, resembling the behavior of a docile kitten. However, it's important to note that Snow Shao is actually a formidable raptor and a fierce creature in the wild. So, why does it behave so obediently like a dog in front of the little girl? Three months ago, Snow Shao got into an accident. That left it with a hole in its wing. The incident occurred because Snow Shao was hunting and flying too fast. And it collided with a parked car. Due to its high speed, it couldn't stop in time. And crashed into the car's bumper. Resulting in severe wing damage and a concussion. Luckily, the little girl's mother was a veterinarian. And she rescued Snow Shao. The owl received medical attention including a shot, which left it quite annoyed. Initially wary of unfamiliar doctors, Snow Xiao's attitude changed. When it learned about a few months of home care ahead, this information seemed to lighten its mood, and it became content at the prospect of receiving care, without the need for further hunting. In order to help Snow Xiao recover quickly, the veterinarian needed to keep the owl close for feeding and monitoring. This is how Snow Xiao came into contact with the little girl, Despite initially being cautious around humans, Snow Shao began to kiss and interact affectionately with the little girl. The two seemed to connect instantly, as if they were old friends. Knowing that life under human care is not easy, Snow Shao started to socialize with the household's cat, forming a new friendship. Snow Shao was smart enough to understand that this new living arrangement came with its perks and privileges. With its newfound companionship, Snow Xiao's health improved rapidly in the loving environment. However, the time came for Snow Xiao to be reintroduced into the wild. The family took Snow Xiao to an open snowy area, preparing to release it. When they opened the box, Snow Xiao hesitated to come out, reluctant to leave the family it had grown so attached to. The little girl's mother had to gently coax Snow Xiao out of the box. Snow Xiao finally emerged, flapping its wings unsteadily as it bid farewell to its human family. Unexpectedly, Snow Shao didn't fly far away. It landed not too far from the family, watching them from a distance. Although reluctant to leave, it eventually took to the sky and flew towards the forest, back to its natural habitat. Have you ever wondered about the relationship between humans and wild animals? It's not uncommon to hear stories of humans encountering wild animals with disastrous outcomes. However, in this video, we bring you an extraordinary account of a young boy who had a heart-stopping encounter with a lioness. What happened next defies all expectations and showcases the incredible bond that can develop between humans and animals. Even in the wildest of circumstances, get ready to witness a story that will leave you in awe. A chance encounter, most of us develop peace, strong and loving connections with our pets, typically cats or dogs. But even small animals can accidentally cause harm while playing. However, they don't possess the ability to cause fatal harm. On the other hand, if someone chooses to keep a lion as a pet, they must be prepared for the dangers that come with owning an adult lion. Even if the lion is initially harmless, its unintentional actions may lead to tragedy. Despite this, many people find lion cubs incredibly cute and irresistible. Like kittens. One day, Adolf came across a lion cub by chance. The people who discovered it thought it was a regular cat and wanted to keep it as a pet. Despite not knowing how to care for it properly, the lion cub appeared to be hungry and frightened. And Adolf knew that he needed to intervene, to protect the young animal from harm. He decided to take the lion cub to a wildlife reserve where it could receive proper care and training. A precious light, during that particular moment. It was a small furry creature that required affection and attention from the world outside. Adolf chose to name the creature Julia which was influenced by the Lion King. 
The name holds significance as it means. The valuable illumination of God shining radiantly in various languages. True to its name. Julia has brought brightness and positivity into Adolf's life. He considers himself to be Julia's adoptive. Father and takes on the role of a parent by caring for. Loving. And playing with her. Guaranteeing her growth to be healthy and joyous. A painful decision, as Julia grew bigger and stronger. It became clear that she could not remain. In the wildlife reserve where they lived. The reserve was too small for her needs. And she required more living space and prey. Adolf had been protecting Julia's growth with his own strength. But new laws made it difficult for the reserve to keep her. When Julia began to demonstrate her natural hunting skills and sneak up on some animals in the reserve, it was evident that she could not stay there any longer. Adolf was faced with a tough decision. He wanted to ensure that Julia could lead a happy life and become a true lion, but he also had to ensure that all animals in the reserve were safe. A new life, releasing Julia into the wild was not a feasible option since lions are based on families. And without a family, Julia would not be able to find food alone. They decided to send her to a specialized institution for large animals. The White Tiger Foundation in Mexico City. Where she could have a good life. Although this meant that Adolf would not see Julia often and that she might forget him. It was the best decision for her and the other animals in the reserve. Julia struggled initially and showed sadness and frustration. But as time went on, she found a new family and restored herself. Adolf never forgot about Julia and always wanted to go and see her. But the foundation cut him off because his arrival would make it harder for Julia to be independent. Julia and Adolf's reunion after seven years of separation. Adolf had enough money and time to visit Julia. Despite concerns that Julia might not remember him or see him as a threat, Adolf obtained permission to enter her enclosure. Julia noticed something unusual, immediately and was pacing back and forth, carefully observing him. When Adolf called her name, she ran towards him and pounced on him causing everyone around them to be startled. However, Julia was not attacking him but rather hugging him and recognizing him. As soon as she saw him, their bond was still as strong as ever. And Julia hugged him tightly with her claws and legs as if she were still a cub. This touching scene moved everyone present as it showed the deep connection between a human and an animal despite the passage of time and the many changes in their lives. Adolf and Julia's bond remained as strong as ever. Although Julia had grown into a huge adult lioness, she still loved Adolf as much as he loved her. The story of Adolf and Julia is a powerful reminder of the incredible connection that can exist between humans and animals even in the wildest of circumstances. It's a testament to the power of love, compassion, and respect for all creatures great and small. Adolf's decision to protect Julia and ensure her well-being is a true act of kindness. And his reunion with her seven years later is a heartwarming reminder of the strength of their bond. Let us all take a moment to appreciate the beauty of the animal kingdom and the importance of treating all creatures with kindness and compassion. A cat owner found that he always felt very uncomfortable recently. So he installed a monitor at home in case of emergency. One day when he turned on the monitor to check his sleep quality, he was stunned by the scene in front of him. The cat at home actually did such a thing while he was sleeping. A young man often had to stay up late because he was going to work. Maybe he stayed up too much. And he felt very uncomfortable and often felt short of breath. As a single man. He had to worry about his body. So he installed a camera at home to prevent any. 
accidents and leave the truth. This day, when he was resting at work, he thought about turning on the surveillance video to see his state during the night. Who knew that he was shocked by the weird scene in the room as soon as he turned it on. He saw the cat raised tiptoed into the room in the middle of the night, then jumped onto my bed lightly, stood beside my pillow, and even touched myself with its paws, as if to prove something. Afterwards, it lay on its body, and its two big round eyes stared at him motionlessly. Seeing this strange scene, even though it was daytime and there were many people around him, the man was still quite frightened. Trembling, he turned on the videos of other nights, and found that almost every night, such a scene would be staged. Now he didn't have the mood to work at all and after finally getting off work. He hurried home and took the cat to the pet hospital. He excitedly told the doctor what the cat had done. But the doctor's answer shocked him again. The doctor said that the IQ of cats is limited. Not high at all. And their IQ is equivalent to that of a one-year-old child. So it is difficult for cats to make correct judgments about things. So energetic. Then the cat will be afraid that the owner will die. The most important thing is that it hopes to be by its master's side no matter what the crisis is. Originally, the man was terrified of the cat's behavior. But now after hearing what the doctor said, his heart was filled with emotion. And his thoughts could not help drifting to a month ago. The fate between him and the cat did not happen in a pet shop. But on his way back from get off work, it was a cold winter night. The man worked overtime as usual. And when he returned home, there was no one there. Only dots of street lights. His mood was extremely bad. After all, he was still alone when he returned home. At this moment, a small black figure in the distance caught his attention. He slowly walked forward and found that it was a kitten shivering from the cold. Seeing that the kitten was as lonely and helpless as himself, the man felt the same in his heart, and quickly took out a ham sausage from his bag. Seeing the cat eager to swallow, the man smiled. This little guy is really cute. Then he poured some water from his thermos for the kitten. After the kitten had finished eating, he was ready to go home. Who knew that at this moment? The kitten, which had recovered its body temperature, hugged the man's leg at once. And its wet eyes seemed to imply to the man, please don't leave me. The man was a little hesitant. He was too busy with his work. And he didn't know if he would have time to take care of such a little guy. But it seemed that it was not a good idea to leave it in the snow. In the end, the man decided to take the kitten home. After returning home together, the man didn't even care about the snow water on his body. He found a basin and began to bathe the kitten. It seemed to feel the man's concern, and the kitty was also very obedient, and did not make a fuss throughout the whole process, quietly cooperating with the man's fiddling. After that, the man went to find a sweater that he didn't wear made a simple nest for the kitten, and then took a shower by himself. On this day, a lonely man and a lonely kitten both found their destinations. They slept very soundly that night. Sometimes companionship is the greatest motivation to move forward in life. The next day happened to be the weekend, and the man saw that the snow outside had stopped. So he took the kitten to the pet store to buy some daily necessities. Out of love for the kitten, he not only bought the necessary cat litter, but also bought a lot of toys for the cat, which made the owner of the pet shop exclaim, You kitty is too happy. In this way, they lived happily. But something seemed to change with the passage of time. But the man didn't notice it. 
until not long ago. Some strange symptoms gradually appeared in his body. And he often felt that his breathing was not smooth. Especially in the middle of the night. He felt as if he was about to suffocate. At first. He went to the hospital for an examination. And the doctor said there was nothing wrong with it. But after returning home. This feeling did not disappear. So he had to ask the doctor again. Perhaps because of the frequent consultation by this man. The doctor also felt a little strange. So he prescribed some cardiopulmonary medicine for the man. But there was still not better. As a last resort. The man had no choice but to complain. About the incident to his friend. Who was also shocked when he heard it. And then suggested that he install a surveillance camera to see if any bad guys had entered his house. Unexpectedly. He saw the scene at the beginning. The reason why I feel breathless in my chest is entirely because the cat is pressing on him. And the long-term oppression makes men feel uncomfortable during the day. But it's not the cat's fault. It's just caring about itself. But thinking of this, the man's heart also began to feel a little sour. When he first brought the kitten home, he often squeezed time to accompany it. But as he gradually became familiar with it and he was busy with work, it seemed that he hadn't been played with the kitten for a long time. Perhaps the kitten was not only afraid of his poor health, but also nestled beside him that night for short-term warmth. After realizing this, the man knew that if he wanted to change the bad habit of the kitten, the most effective way was to lock him up every night. But this was really unfair to the kitten. So after discussing with his friends, the man still felt that he should give the kitten more care. From then on, the man would play with the cat for a while after returning home from get off work every day which also reduced his overtime hours and often took the kitten out on weekends in the process of playing the kitten should also realize that the owner not only loves himself very much but also is in good health so it gradually no longer bothered men at night it's a happy ending and maybe someone would be eager to abandon cats when they find such anomalies because for many people the existence of pets is just to add a touch of color to their lives and if their existence hinders their lives it is still much more messy but this man's behavior deserves everyone's appreciation not only did he not blame the little cat's behavior but he also saw the little cat's good intentions and was able to reflect on himself in time i believe that with such an owner the kitten will be very happy in the future finally i also want to tell you that everything has a spirit and if we give our sincerity to the animals we will definitely get their warm company so please treat them as family members and treat them with heart all right that's all for this video if you like it don't forget to subscribe like and comment we will continue to bring you more touching stories about animals see you next time